Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The Defense Departments of the United States and Japan have taken a substantial stride in bolstering regional security with the formal agreement for the cooperative development of the Glide Phase Interceptor, GPI. This collaborative initiative, under the U.S.-Japan Bilateral Memorandum of Understanding, MOU, for research, development, test, and evaluation, RDTNE, projects, aims to fortify regional deterrence and deepen missile defense cooperation between the two nations. The Glide Phase Interceptor, GPI, project targets the interception and neutralization of hypersonic missiles during their glide phase, the most vulnerable stage between launch and atmospheric re-entry. This phase of a missile's trajectory poses a significant challenge due to its speed and unpredictable flight path. By jointly developing the GPI, the United States and Japan aim to counter emerging hypersonic capabilities, a growing concern in the Indo-Pacific region. Amid North Korea's persistent ballistic missile tests and China's escalating military activities, the need for effective missile defense systems has become increasingly urgent. The GPI program addresses this imperative by leveraging the expertise and resources of both nations. Under this agreement, the U.S. Missile Defense Agency, MDA, will spearhead the development efforts, while Japan will contribute by focusing on the design and production of rocket motors and propulsion components. This collaborative endeavor marks the second joint development of a missile interceptor by the United States and Japan, following the successful standard missile, SM-3 block IIA program. Building on past achievements, the GPI initiative signifies a deeper commitment to enhancing the alliance's deterrence posture and strengthening regional security. The involvement of prominent American defense contractors, Raytheon and Northrop Grumman, underscores the competitive drive to design an effective interceptor. With contracts awarded to continue development, these companies are poised to deliver cutting-edge technology to address the evolving threat landscape. In the words of the U.S. Department of Defense, the development of a counter-hypersonic capability is a pressing need for both countries to address challenges in the Indo-Pacific region, including the emergence of sophisticated missile capabilities for potential acts of coercion. The GPI co-development represents a strategic response to these challenges, built upon long-standing U.S.-Japan missile defense cooperation. By formalizing this agreement, the United States and Japan signal their commitment to enhancing regional security and improving their collective missile defense capabilities. This collaboration not only strengthens the bond between the two allied nations but also underscores their shared resolve to safeguard peace and stability in the Indo-Pacific region. In conclusion, the U.S.-Japan partnership in developing the Glide Phase Interceptor exemplifies proactive cooperation in addressing emerging security threats and underscores the importance of collective defense in an increasingly complex geopolitical landscape. That's all for now. See you later.